Where doom awaits? Why don't you start reading the flavor? Scenario six. You wake into the sound of screeching. Fearing the worst, you grab your equipment and head out into the streets of Dunwich. As you step outside, you sense a foulness in the cold night air. An awful, pungent smell that can scarcely be, de be described and a heaviness of the atmosphere that makes it difficult to breathe. The citizens of Dunwich have sealed their doors and the town feels quiet and lonesome. In the distance, a faint glow emanates from a hilltop above the village. You know of this hill from both your interactions with Zebulon and Armadage's records. It is called Sentinel Hill. The tales speak of satanic rites being performed there, rites in which the great ritual pyres light up the night sky while the ground rumbles furiously below. Flocks of whippoorwills perch on the rooftops of the village area, trying to build suspense with Justin. Whippoorwills! <laughs> Watching ominously as you climb inside Zebulon's old and beat up truck. As you drive towards Sentinel Hill, more screeching fills the sky with an awful pitch that is painful to your ears. Everything you've read about and experienced in Dunwich has led to this. If the foul ritual Seth seeks to perform has anything to do with that, do with what Armadige and his colleagues prevented several months back, it involves the favor of an ancient creature, Yog Sothoth. In bold. It's in bold? He's, yeah, he's important. Failing to stop this ritual may spell doom. Not only Dunwich, but for the entire world. Whipperwheels! Uh, check the campaign log. If Naomi has the investigators back, I do not have that written down, so... I'll have to read as much. <laughs> uh, for reference, um... For part of the setup... We had the minus five chit. We did restore us bishops, so we'll be using Act to assign the hill, instead of the other two Act... Twos. Uh, we had one bird of Yog Sothoth escape into the wild, so we start with one doom on the th thing. And we did not put Sal's bishop out of his misery. Calling forth the old ones. As you approach Sentinel Hill, you hear ancient Latin rites bellowed across the night. The time for action has come. Oh, if you cannot stop the sorcerers in Dunwich, mm -hmm. who knows what terrors they may leash yes, upon the That's world. Wrong. The Whipper Wills. There's 12 mm -hmm. doom on that. Okay. A vibrant arcane energy fills the air with a bone-rattling chill. The energy swirls along the crushed trail before you, and seeps down several other paths before disappearing. Objective, when the investigators have collected the requisite number of clues, they must immediately spend them in an advance. So that's something you should take notice of. Uh, so you do. have to as yeah. soon as you have them. Okay. That is relevant. Um, something Ooh. I do want to point out. Some very mild spoilers, but we we can't lose this one. We can't. We can't lose this one. No, like like, like we game like, like we really don't want to lose this one. Okay. Oh, not so like we can't. Like, no, but like, like it's, we, so not so, as in is not possible, but as in we should not. So we can lose. We do not want to lose this. Sure. Like even if all of us, I mean, like we don't want all of us to die because that means we lose. But like if two of us can die and we can still win, that's. That's a win. Is resigning losing, or is that just a middle ground? Just losing. Okay. <laughs> just we're out. It's done. What do you think? It's like, oh, we're going to summon Yogg Soth out. No, I'm out. That's Face of winning. the hill. The long slope of Sentinel Hill rises before you, crested and jagged edges of Sentinel Peak. Holy shit. Base of the hill. It's scary. Base of the hill is connected to each copy of Diverging Path. Investigate. If you succeed, instead of discovering clues, put a random set-aside Diverging Path into play. Limit once per round. Action, resign, this is more than I signed up for. I well, know what I'm doing. Know, uh, how many snares are with this game? Uh, uh, as doing many as cycles. you want right now, pretty much. Mm -hmm. Like as many as you want to buy, right? Like Yeah, I mean like there's seven of eight for the Dunwich cycle released. So the core set has three scenarios in it. Yeah, yeah which the are first, part of like one big campaign. Yeah. Then the second campaign, which is the Dunwich Legacy. Mm -hmm. The first one, the, the the deluxe box comes with two scenarios, and then there's six individual scenarios. Which also come with player cards. Yes. And then and there's two standalones. Two standalones, yeah. Which are very fun, actually. Yes. Okay, so we're going to investigate and find these. We can also go to the ascending path. Do you want me to just start uh, You cannot move into the ascending path. The path leading up <laughs> the hill is masked. You cannot move into the ascending path. And also, as an additional cost to move to Sentinel Peak, the players must spend two uh, clues per investigator, so this will trigger before we can get to the top of the hill. 
Okay, so like we have to, we can't go up this path, we have to go around. Yes. Okay. Yeah, we gotta do the diverging path. Uh, I'll go first then. Yeah, because you're, you can... I'm the investigate guy. Once per, uh, once per turn? Once per round. Oh, okay, so we can, yeah, if you go first, then I'll duke my way into it. Yeah. Oh god, we're under the hill, we're underground. Yep. I mean, that's more important than whatever we're doing. Three, I have base four. Nah, no, nothing's more important than what I'm doing. I'll play Dr. Milan Christopher for my first act. Oh yeah, <laughs> what we have for permanence? I have higher education play. I have charisma, so if I play three allies in total with Duke, don't yell at me, I'm not cheating. <laughs> I have adaptable, so in between scenarios I'm allowed to switch zero level cards out of my deck without paying XP for them, up to two. And streetwise, I can pay, spend two resources to get plus three book or plus three foot for a test. So I played Dr. Milan Christopher for my first action, drew for two, and then said five cards in hand so I can get the plus two book from my higher education. Seems good. For this investigation. So I have seven to the game three. Seven to the game three. I have charisma. Follow up and ask, how's it going? You're good. Success. So we add one of the set aside diverting diverging paths. Okay. I get a resource, right? Yeah. Because this is a successful in yep. investigation, whether it's so we had now a, find clues or not. A diverging yep. path. Alright. <clears throat> he subtly hints. Not an altered path, because those sound shitty. Yeah. Alright, pulled one out random. And those are your three actions? The smile of Twinkle. You'll have to check out the YouTube video for that one. Just not edit that in after. Yeah. <laughs> um, so you're done? Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'll start by duking my way into there. Duke smells something. Uh, a bath, a path off the beaten trail leads deeper into the woods surrounding Sentinel Hill. I mean, none of us have bathed in this whole trip. Yeah, uh, well, I mean, like, maybe you Well, I haven't. I just <laughs> actually can't feed. I mean, like, we stayed in that town for a day or two or whatever. Yeah. I probably have. I look pretty, pretty good. Uh, destroyed path. Forced. After you reveal destroyed path, place one doom on it per player. Uh, if you if you, uh, investigate, if you succeed, instead of discovering clues, remove one doom from it. Oh, that's cool. He lied. <laughs> <laughs> this one starts with 12 doom? Holy shit. This one's gonna be a long one. <laughs> I don't know, we're at four. Don't worry about it. I failed in my investigation. I'm gonna need Rex to come in here next turn. I guess. Um, and then I'm gonna... One do. I mean, like, there's no rush, really, right? Yeah. I could potentially you getting investigate more locations and is, head You back getting more in locations there. is important. Um, so I mean, like, the, the whole thing is, like, I can spend my turn investigating here, moving here, and then investigating here, right? Yeah, I'm gonna grab this baseball bat. Bats are good. Mm -hmm. And I'm just gonna... Stock up. And, uh, I'm gonna get two money. And we're gonna play the twin 45s. There we go, he's ready to rock. <clears throat> I mean, like, monsters in this one are scary when they show up. Yep. Yeah, so, so like, like the you know, beasts, right? Yeah. Maybe we wanna have something, I don't know. Yeah. Something better than this. <laughs> so, <laughs> better than, like, punch. <laughs> nobody moves. Um, we all flip all mini cards, unexhaust everything, draw a card, gain a resource. Uh, start a turn, Doom. Yeah, bring your first player. It's good. We're good. You're good. Oh, fuck me. Uh, we do not currently have a Sentinel Hill location in play, do we? We have yes. Sentinel Peak. Sentinel Hill, Sentinel Hill. Sentinel Hill. <laughs> <laughs> yes, oh, okay. we do. Yeah. <laughs> Very good, then. Uh, Travis. Yeah. Would you like to join me in this brain test? No, really. How about What's... you don't have a choice? How much? What is it? It's not a peril, so... Yeah, like, you can share... Uh, it's, a, it's a brain test four. If you fail, you take two meat damage. <laughs> oh, fuck. Your brain can't comprehend what's happening, so you puke, right? Uh, Something like... Help me out here, Henry. Uh, I'm gonna discard a dust from my... Five to the games, whatever. Four. Sorry, you should go first in I case you draw first. another guts. And you can help me out. <clears throat> The damage is much worse on me. Ooh, what's Minus that do? Minus one. Minus one? Yep. I'll pass. Okay. 
and draw a card. Do you have anything you'd like to help me with? I don't believe. No, I don't. Five to four. four. Yeah, oh. get fucked. Take two hearts. <laughs> Mine, Obscuring Fog. Gets plus two shroud here. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> yeah. Uh, really, it's not awful. Altered Beast of Neural Abomination enemies in play against Surge. Oh, we have this one. Yep. That sucks. Yep. Uh, all right, I'm gonna test. Actually, one. that one's not that bad. That's not the. But hard. isn't this the, this is the set that has? Yeah, the but there's one. like only two of them in that stack. Yeah, but you two are both gonna you're gonna get it. Just yeah, if I get, we're just we're fucked. <laughs> just come out. This is Game's more than I signed on for. I'll resign. Mm -hmm. Oh, I failed by one point. Mill one. That seems totally fine. Okay, our actions. Rex, you should try to get see through that fog. I'm thinking, yeah, you should go first. Hey, Rex! Yes. Follow the sound of my hey, voice. Re hey, Rex, what? <laughs> <laughs> what do you want? I mean, four, five, I guess. Pass me a thing. Six, seven of the game's five. Holy Not a perception. Eight, nine of the game's five. I spent a lot of my higher education for yeah. that. You're good. I'll draw a card. Get another thing. I get a resource back. Discard Obscure Fog? Yeah. Another Diverging Path. Uh, I'm gonna go move into yours and deal with, try and deal with that this turn. Seems right. great. Three. After you reveal it. Okay. Yeah. And then, yeah, we'll investigate for... I mean, like, we'll spend the money because it's free. <laughs> Seven the game's three. Combo. I mean, no, the cards we spent lots of experience on are good. Thank you, Brian. Yeah, no, I got nothing. Minus one. Yep. Well, does it, it get worse? I get money back. Uh, if you're on an altered location, it's minus oh, three. Oh, okay. Yeah. But we don't have any of those in play no, right now. Not that we know of. Yeah. I mean, there's these set aside ones called altered paths that have the al altered subtype. So. So maybe. Uh, I'm going to move into here with my lucky duke. After you reveal Eerie Glade, discard the top two cards for each of your deck for each action I have remaining. So I have one action remaining. Don't you have two? No, because I moved in here. Oh, okay, yeah. Uh, no, a lot of these things will punish you if you have... Or were those in that custom game we were cutting out? Shit. I don't know. I really wasn't paying attention to that. I was cutting pieces of paper. I know. I have four to four. Oh. Okay. Good job, Duke. One of six. Oh, shit, why do I have a phone on? It's not on my phone. Bad Justin. Okay. Have yeah, no, it's this one. This, a lot, some of these things will punish you if you move into them and have actions left. Or have no actions left. Depending on which one it is. Oh, oh good. I'm going to push the objective. <laughs> so, so try to move into them all with a middling amount of actions <laughs> remaining. Yeah, like on your second action, ideally. Um, I'm gonna... Were oh, there clues on that location? Yeah. Yeah, oh, damn. That's the people, thank you so much for the cheer! Eh, I'm gonna just fail it and be like, actually no. Uh, uh, I'm gonna just be lucky because then I'm gonna draw two cards. Cool. You're up, friend. Well, none of these things are like me problems. So I'm gonna gain a money, and then we'll spend all our money here. <laughs> what do you mean there's any problems? You have like three book, do something. <laughs> spend it all for lucky dice. You can spend a money for two for and three book. I know. You spend two, two money for three book. Plus and liquid, shopping. liquid courage. I'm busy finding the liquor because Rex is gonna get mad if he isn't. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> We're trying to do a serious thing here, right? <laughs> Right. Oh, okay, sorry, my bad. Money, money card. card. I have my current phobia. That's fine, I can spend that and then, like, kill the Doom off this my, on my turn. Yeah. I would prefer if you leave one clue in that location, Justin. Can't, I mean, yeah, I can come back. Just in case, because I don't know what other loca other things have. Yeah, definitely, of course. And I have some cards that only do things on clue locations. Sure, not a problem at all. Uh, Doom. 
good. I cannot play assets or events, so I guess I'm doing other shit this round. Do you want to uh, try to find a new path? And... Uh, I could go here and try to investigate this one because it's like it's three either way, right? Like, and yeah. I have three. Am I good? Yeah. Oh, I'm frozen in fear. Okay, so. That's good. Flip each non-sentinel hill location to its unrevealed side, removing all clues from it. Each, each revealed non-sentinel hill? Each non-sentinel hill location to its, unrevealed, to its unrevealed side. But this one remain, retains its doom, yeah? Because it just says clues. Yeah, I mean, the whole point of this card is to confuse on which one's which. So presumably, oh, they shuffle together then. Yeah. Oh, okay. Then yeah, I say the doom goes too. Okay. Because that wouldn't. That do we go back? Do we go to the base it. of the hill? No. Each investigator and enemy at a location flipped in this way immediately moves to the nearest sentinel hill location. So yes, yeah, sorry. And then shuffle them. All two cards. Huh. All right. It's called the spaces between. Well, that's kind of good because we like we have one clue off that, but then we at least turn get another thing. Yeah, I mean we basically just gained two clues, right? Kind of. Um, huh. Let's well, let's. My that's I go neat. first. Dump my chromophobia. Explore one of the locations. Yeah, or even uh. And then like you even can do just something. even just spawn a new location. Yep. Yeah. And then I can go to the new one. That's probably better for me to spawn a new one. I will spend two actions here. My chromophobia. Oh, oh. Man. there's a thing in here that. It's gonna mill you too, and then shuffle all the weaknesses in your discard back in your deck. Just so you guys are aware. Okay. That's it, that's it. That can come up. I'll spend the money, so I got seven of the games three again. So we're calling it the Rex's Curse Syndrome. Sure. Uh, reveal another token. Zero. You're fine. That one cancels the things, right? It does, yes. Okay, so go, go, Diverging Path. So, do you want me to step into here? I guess that's like the safe one. I yeah. get money from that. I mean, I can also just like... This can actually sit here. Cool. I'm also just going to gain a resource, just in case that punishes you for having actions left. And then I'll move inside. That's pretty fair. Whoop! Slaughtered Woods! Oh, that sounds good. Oh. <laughs> After you reveal Slaughtered Woods, take two horror if you have no actions remaining. <laughs> so it got me. You shouldn't have taken the resource. I should have. That's okay, bro. But I'll investigate here. There's three clues. What did you see in the woods? You know, like, there's terrible things you like, drink up. <laughs> <laughs> hey, oh, I'll you forget. Pete, you, 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 you want some liquor? <laughs> Dude, you just drink in the middle of the day. We're trying to do with it. She's like, well, there's nothing here for me to do. <laughs> well, like, what else am I supposed to do? You want to drink? Roll some dice? Or right, you're homeless. You're poor. Oh, yeah, right. One of those homeless people. <laughs> One of them. He's like, he's like, oh, my God. We face like over and we're together. Up. And you're demeaning me because I'm poor. All right, I'll move in here because it doesn't do anything bad to me unless I have no actions remaining. Right? Correct. Hey, you want a drink, Pete? Yes, please. What do I do? Uh, test brain two. Like heal one, then test brain two. Then heal another one if you pass. Cool, thank you. <laughs> Pete's like, yes. <laughs> yes, I would like a drink. I live on a train. <laughs> uh, I'll investigate. Yeah, sure. Three, two. Three to two. You hit pay three, so this is no. five to two. Oh, boom. Shit. I don't need that shit. I'm going to get a money, too. And I'm done. And around? Did you test for your first yes, one? Yes, I did. Yeah, this is gone. gone. I wanted to tell you guys, Ooh, just, just in case something comes sweets. We're paranoid. Oh, fuck. How many do you have? Three. Oh, okay, that's not that bad. This dust. Uh, I found the baboons uh, which, and chicken. Which order do just I Just in case. Mean? Why are you keeping your peppers and chicken? 
That's what I have for the uh, one card, the baboons and chicken card. Yeah, but why are you keeping your baboons in a chicken? No, the, uh, the ch it's chicken and baboons in a cage, and I open it up and they fly out. Draw and a card and gain the resource. So I gain, I gain the two after I draw the card. The card would love yeah. if you didn't keep the chicken with baboons to begin with. <laughs> <laughs> baboons! Uh, card, Doom and Kurtz? Yeah, got the Doom. Oh, sick. What's your feet, Justin? I have three feet, which is weird, I know. Okay, don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you must test brain four. Excuse me? You gotta send a hill location. Oh, God, this it's is... gonna be the same one. Is it peril? No. It's the same one I had, right? Oh, yeah, sure. Like it does two damage to you. Oh, yeah. oh, fuck me. Don't worry about it. I can't heal you for that one. Apparently liquor doesn't work for injuries of the flesh. Book four. So like I can only pass on a plus one if I use that. It's nice when you draw a card that doesn't affect you. You can just be like... A new rule. Rex isn't allowed to sit in Sentinel Hill locations. Yeah. I mean, we're gonna... He's just accepting that the world's like changing around and we're just like, yeah, this With this sense. preposterous sketches on so we have like a slightly better chance to survive. We survive on a zero and a one. Plus one. Can you do that depending on if there's a clue on your location? I'm uh, committing like it. he's committing oh. it instead of playing it. Yeah. Oh, okay, I see, I see. Yeah, no, I have other cards that are templated differently. Okay. Oh, get fucked me. Take two hearts. Stop taking damage. I can't do anything about it. I didn't even draw these cards. If they were, I, they wouldn't have happened. This isn't my fault. This is your guys's. This is your fault for being in a Sentinel Hill location. Fuck you, I was told to stay here. By who? Justin. You no. listen to a homeless man? Yes. <laughs> I live in a bus. I'm drunk. What do you want? Alrighty. At least he has a uh, dog. He's probably he's clearly made better life choices than I have. Duke's my dog. Can I get Duke liquor? I'm I'm leaving. This place is a show. No, it can only work on investigators. <coughs> my dog is my investigator. I love him. Okay, this is the Doom one. Okay. <laughs> I drink too much liquor. <coughs> <laughs> I mean, we're gonna try and get Doom off this, I guess. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The game's free. Could you not put the Doom on the shroud? Well, you and put him on the other side. You even memorized everything? Uh, for the games, take the thing off. There we go. And, uh, we'll. I get one, and I'll do it again. Curse garbage. <laughs> okay. I can probably get the clue to still here. Sure, I guess I'll go into here then. Yeah. So I'll go, oh fuck, my goddamn frozen up here. That's okay. Move here. We'll duke into this one. My second, my third action. Eerie Glade. Um, one turn. And that's the one where I lose if I have actions remaining, right? Top yeah. cards? No actions remaining. Perfect. Four to four. Like it was planned that way. Get fucked. <laughs> Minus three. I fail. <laughs> you wear weakness is gone. That's actually probably a pretty fair trade. Yeah, I'm okay with that. All right, that's it for me. All right, I'll investigate here. If you do succeed, we do just have to flip it. Oh, do we? Okay, do we want to then? Do we? Uh, no, I think we need two more. I mean, right? We need. Oh, it's two per play. Right, right, right. Never mind. Okay. Then I will investigate. Yeah, it's one of these ones. Yeah. Minus two. I'll fail. No. This work off. When you guys draws a thing that kills me, I'm gonna be mad. You made your choice, Rex. I'll I didn't a make any choices. You yeah, by being squishy. Physically, mentally, you're great. 
Well, someone had to be. Uh, this was not bad. Sick. Uh, Doom. It's just a six. <sighs> Halfway there. Just mills everyone three? Yes. Okay. However, it instructs me to discard them. <laughs> Here you go, friend. <laughs> uh, if it were like an altered location. Is that the Rougarou? No. No, it's a thrall. <laughs> Thank God, no. though. <laughs> shows up okay. just like. Ugh. It does the spawn on you. Or on Pete. Oh, Pete? Pete? Yeah, oh, right, no, you guys are. Sorry, I missed. Who was I'm there? at a different place. I was like, you were asking your Oh, I didn't even test my uh, frozen up here. Miss triggers. Miss trigger. Not still frozen up here. Well, yeah, this is um, bad to kill now. I have this abomination. I'm gonna attach it to this guy. You see an abomination? Yes. Oh shit. Whenever you uh, whenever you enter attached enemy's location or vice versa, take one horror. I'm hoping to kill him this turn. Uh, me too. I'll go first then. Yeah. That just sounds good. Do it. Let's yeah. hit this guy with the baseball just bat. Get him. <laughs> okay, <laughs> with your dog. <laughs> Pick up the dog by the front <laughs> mic. <laughs> 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 yeah, let's hit <clears throat> four to two. You look at that. It's dead. Sporch. <laughs> Good stuff. Seems fine. Those are two actions, all right? Yes, investigate with Duke here, just so I have something to do with my life. Clean that up. Oh, Ooh. minus five. Test my frozen in fear. I'll just put that one in. Minus one. I'm fine. See you later, frozen in fear. This one's not altered, right? No. There we so go. So, Bryn. So that was pretty good. I think we want me to move back the path and then back in there and try and get it. So you can go explore it, because that's much safer than me trying to explore with my two sure. remaining health. I'm definitely not planning to jerk around with my cards. <laughs> One, two. Or right. Oh you didn't get one. One, two, three, four. Yeah, you can get one. You what? We could have him go first or No, we're gonna go to the Eerie Glade because if I, I mean, succeed like by two or more, then I get both of them and we can flip it and bring can Take his turn doing that. Yeah. One, two. Invest. And then both these guys will come into him. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I don't like these guys, bro. Eight, nine. Yeah, the only place they can move is here. Yeah, for this turn, yeah. Eleven to the game is four. One. <laughs> Just minus one. Uh, I'll take two clues. Get a resource back, and then we immediately spend. Yeah. During your search through the wood paths around the base of Sentinel Hill, you come across a startling sight. A herd of sheep lays dead upon the ground in a oh! secluded clearing, their bloody carcasses placed in a strange but careful pattern. Holding your nose against the stench of death, you step over mangled sheep on your way to the center of the odd formation. In the center of the sheep lies the corpse of a man. A clear jewel has been firmly pressed into his forehead, caving in the front of his skull. His eyes are wide, his face contorted in a vision of fear, as if beseeching you for mercy. Though you know better, you check for a pulse. As you touch the man's skin, the jewel in his forehead dissolves, and the woods around you seem to clear. The arcane presence masking the path further up the hills fade. Reveal ascending path. You remove all clues from each location in play. The sending path connects to each copy of altered path. If you succeed in investigate, if you succeed instead of discovering a clue, put a random set aside altered path into play. <sighs> Fuck. You guys are gonna have to investigate that one. I can't uh, risk the thing. We got ascending the hill V1. As you ascend the hill, the environment around you grows increasingly strange and otherworldly. The arcane energy feels even stronger here, crackling in the air and crawling on your skin. Clues cannot be placed on non-altered locations. When an investigator enters Sentinel Peak, advance. Okay. So we should get six clues again. Shift those down. Because I, I mean, don't like, imagine I'll be using them as much. And, it, like, unless it's this one, right? Like, yeah. No. That's the only one. But still, like, the altered pass can be much more important. Enemy turn? Uh, I get to go still. Yeah, you're right. That's the reason we did it the way we did. 
What about it? Nothing. <laughs> Come on, that's um, I'm going to play Leo first. So we've drawn him and we have five. Drawn him and we can. And that's pretty good. I don't want to go here because then I'll fight these right away. I'd rather fight them on my own terms. Okay, then. So, like, I'll move. Do other things, I guess. Here. And uh, we'll grab the money. Okay. And then end turn. Uh, so, these guys are going to go here. Head down the hill, yeah. That's scary. They're just like. Money and card. Doom. Oh, sick. No search? No. Fuck this horse shit. Right, that's what we're doing this turn. We got an avian throw. Oh, that's something different for you to do this turn. Kill this man. No, I can't kill that many. I think I'm You have to kill that man. I'm always going to climb the hill and add two doom to the thing. I can help you with all this, Brim. All right. I mean, like, I would spawn a location with the most clues. Where does it spawn, then? Uh, it's your choice. Oh, Dump him, like, in there. He's garbage. It's true. Does he have prey or anything? No, he just sends things over here. He's just a guy. Yeah, just dump him there. Alright. I'll come in first, Bryn. Alright. And I have a bunch of monkey meat. We'll automatically evade everybody here. <laughs> Friendly movies slightly off the side. Yeah. <laughs> Which one is the one that we want to kill first? Yeah, this kill guy? this guy. Oh, we don't have to. I mean, like, not this turn, but, like, we want to kill him. I'll deal two damage to him. And we're really going to actually use this yeah, card to his be. advantage. Can you mind those like, pie rolls? You can come visit you guys, too. Yeah. We'll worry about that when we get here. Time out. Get him with your bat. Oh, uh, that's it for me. I did three. <clears throat> Get him with your gun. <laughs> As I expect you to use your gun. That sounds... Unless you want to go first, but like... I, I mean, I'm gonna like, dirtle. If you got something to do, then yeah, sure. If not, I'll like engage in I mean, Mortal like, Kombat in theory, with this do we want, farm Do we guy. want me to like... Because this is five. It doesn't matter either way, right? Really. Yeah, you're feeling... In theory, I can do Like, my gun does space. plus one damage either way, right? So... Yeah. Like, it's, it's either two hits for this guy. And it's or a ranged weapon? Is hit. this ranged? Yeah, it's, it's a firearm. Oh, so it's minus three attack. Yeah. Oh, no, it's not. So ranged. he gets, he oh, gets minus yeah. three attack. He gets okay. minus three fight. All right. Then so he's only two because guns are, guns are easier to shoot birds Seems with. Seems good. Checks out. It checks out. Do you want the big combat phase to be now? Or I don't care. Turn? Uh, I'll go first then. Yeah. We'll have it be the. Sure. Uh, I'll play the Berkeley for one. You should move in here. You have lower feet than me, right? Oh no, fuck, we all have three. <laughs> I'll play this Pathfinder for three. And I'll play this Emergency Catchy for th get three back. I could move in there, but I really don't want to. If you move in here, you just take damage, right? Yeah, I might just... He's got, or did they just attack the person they engaged to? Just the person they engaged to. And I think if we're all there, we gotta choose, right? Well, like, we'll all get to, we'll get to choose because we're all the same feet. Yeah. yeah. Value. Yeah. So I can take one, no problem. Yeah, yeah, right. I, I really can't spend too much time on the hill locations in case we flip that thing that hits me for two. Like, failing both of them crippled me pretty uh, hard here. Especially since, like, the effect you're going to the destroyed path to try and... Hmm? Oh, I'm done. I did yeah. three things. I'm going to spend a thing to try and shoot this devotee of the key. Um... Yeah, we'll be we'll be uh, overpowering. Overpowering. We'll be oh, seven. We'll be seven to three. I really just want this guy to die. This is my turn. We offer second. Minus two. Yeah, he'll die as well. Brin's killing things. I'll draw. Okay, then we'll try and shoot this avian throw. Minus five, you say. Uh, so what, he's two, I've got three. Sure, we'll fail. 
We'll shoot him again. <gasps> Boom, that's a billion. Let's deal, deal two damage to him. And then with our Leo De Luca action, we'll try and shoot him again. Yeah. Oh fuck. Okay, let's draw a different token, please. <laughs> um, and reveal another one. Minus one, I'll kill him. He is dope. He is das Totenbuch. Alright, end of the turn. Uh, that's all I got, yeah. Alright, these guys move in. I'll take one, you take one. Sure. That seems fair, right? Does seem fair. Uh, we take some damage from them. Uh, I'll dump mine on Leo. I would love one of like the six allies in my deck, please. Uh, I may have lost two of them though. I have. Oh. Okay, Doom. So we're on seven, eight. Yeah. Uh, I guess I get to draw this oh, first. Right, right. Draw this, do this. Oh, we're in. Oh shit, Brandon, does that sound good? No, this is good. This is good. We're on nine doom now. Good. That was my card. Woo! Uh, you guys can draw a card in my resource. Right? No. Right. Okay. no. Thank you. you. didn't touch your stuff because it's card probably well. safer. Rex gets mad if we touch his stuff. I do. I'll, I'll fail this one all day. Three to the five. Boom. Mill five. Don't care. See you later, curse. Yeah. I have dissonant voices, which kind of mucks us up a bit, but it'll be okay. I hate retaliate. That keyboard can fucking die. This turn's all about you guys. So. Do you want to go first or shall I? You should go first. This dissonant. Yeah. All right, do you need me to damage yours? No, I mean, I think, you worry about yours first. Okay. I'm going to shoot at mine. That's not very good. I can help, maybe. Sure, we'll just go to Hard Knocks to make it so that I have six to four. Uh, let's draw a different one. Thank you, Lucky Dice. No, oh, fuck. <laughs> I'll fail. I'll take some damage. Lucky Dice out. Lucky Dice out. Shit. Uh, yeah, that's really bad. That's super bad. Got lucky this too. Uh, I got I killed something with them already. That's probably not that's really bad though. Or are they? I How feel the like they're gonna kill this thing now. Especially I mean, for someone like him that produces a lot. Yeah. I mean they aren't right now, but they will be good. Were well, these the damn dogs that killed us last time? Yes. <laughs> I mean, like, I guess I'll fucking... Man, this is so bad. <sighs> well, how's it going? Uh, fuck. It takes so much damage this turn. Lucky dice, or are they? Or are they? Uh, not this time. Where's my big man on campus?
every option I have is like worse than the last one. Because <laughs> like if I keep shooting this guy, I'm probably just gonna die this turn. Yeah, maybe it's best. It's like to a just... thousand damage. I could just like end my turn and hope the card I draw changes this, but I don't know what it could be. I have things that can help. I just this really fucked this up. Like we had a good thing going yeah. until these goddamn dissonant voices started telling me that Duke's a bad dog. <laughs> Duke's a good dog. I like Duke. We used to play magic, just not. I mean, like, yeah, alright. We'll try again. Boom. Oh. Deal two damage to him. Sick. Scam. Fuck, I think we just gotta go for it. So lucky, good. you're the lucky dice. The luck was in you all along. You didn't need any Turns dice. Out to I didn't lucky. need the dice. Do you have one action left? Uh, yeah, I shot him three times, so I've got the Leo action left. Maybe punch, punch Justin's guy. So if I, okay, so like if I try to punch Justin's guy. Oh, yeah, you fail, he gets hit. With the three mind. fight I have to his four, if I fail, he gets hit and I get hit. Oh, well, you get the plus one. <laughs> I've just flipped two blue tokens in a row. I don't think it gets better from here for me. It could. You could flip the third one. I think I'm just going to play this fire axe instead so I have something to go with. That's pretty fair. I guess I'll go. Um, I gonna... mean, like, I can go if you want to think about things for a while longer, but, like... No, I think my plan is pretty simple. I am a lucky, lucky girl. Which is attack with the big. I mean, like, kind of, that balances out you losing the lucky dice. Uh, yeah, losing the lucky dice on, like, use two of them sucks. You're well, just gonna fine. buy them back, you fuck. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't know, if I get enough, if I get enough, uh... XP? Enough XP, I might buy, like, the ace and the hole and stuff. It depends what's the next Mythos pack, too. Yeah. Because some of those cards would be insane. Yes! Two damage. With some unexpected courage. Nice. I could technically help you, but it doesn't actually help you, so... What is that? We mean? probably should not is follow that line of play. <laughs> I, I'm sure I don't know. Alright, well this guy is just gonna fucking murder me. Like, this is the guy who killed me last time. This card's now very likely not as useful, so I'm gonna go commit oops to this one. Yeah, that's fair. This is pretty fair. I mean, like, without the dissonant voices... Oh, that's voices, that, that like, was what I was gonna do. This fuck, turn. yeah, that's and insane. And then they were like, Duke's a bad dog. And I was like, reveal the top, describe the top two cards. Minus seven, huh? <laughs> fucked. Uh, yeah. Alright. It seems bad. Alright, well... I'd rather just fucking kill him, I guess. So, hey, I have a stroke of luck. He's dead. <laughs> Don't even have to lose this. Alright, Travis, you're up. There's no monsters in your way. <laughs> Do profitably like Pathfinder here, come here, explore location, move into it. Hope for the best. <laughs> Is that worth me like maybe dying though? Yeah, sure. I would say. I mean, we, Britt and I took risks like we're at a disadvantage. <laughs> You're right, let's do it. Yeah. Uh, Pathfinder gotta... here, move here. Uh, let's investigate three, four, five, or three. So, like, plus one, plus two, plus three, plus four, plus five, plus six. Did he comment on Chad saying Gwen is a lucky, lucky girl with a wink? Nice do it. Yeah. It's... You're not it's... wrong. You're moving into it? Yeah. Uh, a shiver courses up your spine as you step forth onto the path. Oh, no. It's route touched by bars bizarre arcane power. How many actions do you have remaining? Zero. Take two damage. Regular damage? Yep. Oh, yeah, get fucked. You can no. kill him. Oh, yeah, I totally can. Fuck you, Christopher. I get a resource back off him first, too. That's a good point, Justin. This is not a central central hill location. Thank yet. God. I mean, like it says, those things are consistent on the front and the back. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Yep. Thank you. So sorry, Someone Rex. Like cursed you and said that we should have Rex die. I don't want you to die, Rex. You should uh, probably okay. carry some pills or something. Maybe next time. 
<laughs> We're a little busy right now. Uh, end of turn? Yep. Draw a card and a resource. That's good. That was a great draw. That makes us that much less likely to die this turn. I guess another course would be to move here and then the gun. I'm really the, scared of the one this place. This is 12, dude. Eight, nine, 10. We have 10. Uh, cards. Bryn. I should just move to that other altered path, and, or that yeah. destroyed path. 11. I'm frozen for you. That's dust. Oh. We advanced him. Fuck. As you explore the path surrounding the Sentinel Hill, the chanting of the hilltop rises to a crescendo and takes an otherworldly quality, reverberating through the trees as if carried by unseen currents. The world begins to change. The grass and trees dissolve like sugar in a cup of tea. A vast, endless sky slices through reality you see before you when you feel drawn to it, terrified and awestruck. The arcane power becomes distorted and seeps around you, creating strange alterations in the land. Shuffle this card pile into the entire deck. No. Uh, beckoning for power. The old ones were, the old ones are, and the old ones shall be. Not in the spaces we know, but between them. They walk serene and primal, undimension, and to us unseen. Yogg-Sothoth knows the gate. Yogg-Sothoth is the gate. Yogg-Sothoth is the key and guardian of the gate. Past, present, future, all are one in Yogg-Sothoth. He knows where the old ones broke through of old and where they shall break through again. He knows where they have trod Earth's field and where they still tread them and why no one can behold them. Just casual. This is kind of casual. This doesn't even do anything. It's just 10 doom. <laughs> like, fuck. <laughs> I'm scared oh, of this. I feel like Yogg Sothoth might break free. Thoughts? No, we're better than that. Thoughts, quandaries? We're better now. We're on normal, Justin. We got this. Cards? The turn. Oh no, we just did that. Okay. Because mine was the one that's. Oh yeah, yeah. Now it's our. Now it's us. Now it's just us. I mean, I'm gonna sit here and get clues. Yeah, seems good. I'll go first. Yeah. You guys get that? Yeah. Investigate. No. Commit deduction. Nine. One, two. Six to the games three. I think I'm gonna go try to deal with this. Six. Eight to the games three. Yeah. Eight. Ah, ten to the games three. Play safe. Fuck me. Fail. Um Investigate again. We'll just do six to the games three this time. Take two clues, please. They're gonna play emergency cash for three money, and that's my turn. Sick. I suppose I'll go before you, Brain, if that's okay. Test Brain for my first one, fear. Oh, that's right. Nice. This is like a real opportunity for whether I want to do that or not. I actually feel like it would be worth it. Frozen of Fear doesn't hurt you as much. It doesn't because I have the Pathfinder too. Yeah, because you can do this and worst case then come in here get a new one, right? I feel like it's fine. I'll, I'll be comfortable failing and drawing three cards, yeah, I think. Yeah, 100%. I mean, not 100%, but like... Oh, I, no, I think that's an easy... Okay, I don't think it's 85%. easy, but that's... Yeah. Hey, I'm, like, I'm comfortable doing it, but I don't think it's 100. Duke! Lucky. Found a path. <laughs> Oh my god, I just need to do something quickly. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So okay. you found a path, right? Yes. Alright, so this one was if you have no actions left, so I'm going to assume this one is if you have actions left. I mean, there's one more too, right? Yeah. I mean, there's probably one that punches you for There's probably one that's like this, that's just like, fuck you, why'd you come here? Yeah. <laughs> you so, idiot. I'm going to fire a flare into the air and shoot the top nine cards of my deck for an ally. Let's see how much experience we can burn this round. <laughs> I have nine allies. Nine cards left, let's grab him. <laughs> just had nine cards left, I haven't seen a copy of him yet. <laughs> 
Like, like man, I'm okay. He's all like, yeah, you called? I mean, I feel like, yeah. <laughs> he's like, holy shit, that, that hill is steep, man. I yeah, run, that's a lot of running. <laughs> I had to run here from Arkham. Here. <laughs> After you reveal lost memories, take one horror for each action you have remaining, which is zero. We'll play. Friend, you're up. It is a continent. What the fuck is the other basic weakness I have? <laughs> I'll move here. And it's hyper hypochomia or whatever. It's it's dust. I mean, like if I draw it, I have to get rid of it because I'll die if I, I don't. I will investigate but... here with perception. I hope you find it. Good luck, Jenny. Minus three. Hey, I don't. Yeah, right, I'll try again. I'm streetwise. That helps me in the woods for some reason. Yeah. Uh, it okay. should be a doom here. A road would be perfect here, is what you say. And then you're like, yes. Done. Perfect. Let's get rid of that doom, and then last action, I'll draw a card. That's it for everybody? Yep. Yeah. Uh, I think it's it for me anyway. Yeah, so. you were the last, okay. Card and a resource. Duke stands up. Doom. Did you shuffle your stuff? Yes. Oh no, okay, off the flare, okay. Yeah, just yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. I thought like this. Oh, I have some, some dissonant voices. Hand size is eight, right? Yeah. I got a right tell, but fuck that garbage. I'm not shuffling that. This is well, I just investigated in a Sentinel Hill location, which is none of us. <sighs> oh man. You have no idea how happy I'm to see that card gone. <laughs> Alright, our turn. So we need, how many things do we have? We currently have two? Yep. I can get this third one pretty easily. I can go to your location, like, I might be able to get all this. I could attempt to find one, another path then. We don't need another path, I don't think. I think that one's gonna be a bit No, yeah, that's here. right, yeah, we do. We, we, only we have, have the clues Yeah, we have right? enough, yeah, that's all we do. So, why don't... Yeah, why don't you do your stuff first? Okay. Uh, I'll play this magnifying glass. Oh, this little bug is weird. This is no normal bug. This is not a normal I mean, bug. That's a little awkward. I imagine this guy's waiting for I could the try. Top of the I could try and get this one if you want, Travis. I know. I'm just I can thinking, move. No, there it's just from a frozen fear. Right. a little awkward now. I mean, like if you pathfinder move and then move in here, that's perfect because then you don't take damage for any remaining actions. Well, no, it's to here. Like pathfinder move here. This is only on reveal. Yeah. Oh, okay. I can like move Pathfinder here in the move and then investigate. Yeah. Or I could draw like a thousand cards. I could also, like, if you investigate this one, I could leave some clues for you here. Like, I, I won't go hang I don't have much your, else to do. Either I'm moving to your thing and trying to get those, or I'm not investigating this location at all. Not at all? Yeah. Because I want this clue to be here to, in case I draw something very bad. Okay. I think I'm going to take a bit of a turn off here. What if get you investigate then move in here? As an alternative. It's not what I want to do, but I think I, I can make that work. Investigate. What's Brian do on his turn then? I'll figure something out. He's going to go shopping. Like I'd rather have... I mean, like, fuck, whatever. Right? I'd rather have me do nothing and then, like, have Bryn move into your space and you two try to clear out that location. Yeah, I just... I just always hate turns when we have to, like, do nothing, right? We're not really doing nothing, though. We're just... We're setting up. We gotta fight this asshole. Yeah, Bryn will fight that asshole. <laughs> Bryn and I will. Is there... Really? He's relatively soft. No, he really is. This uh, Mythos thing is just kind of like Yogg Soth all his greatest hits. Yeah. And this guy's like, he's just some guy who's a Yeah, if you, way, if you feel more comfortable head. staying here. I mean, I just, I feel like I can get, I can accomplish more by not getting this clue than I can by like, it feels really bad to like spend my turn Pathfinder in here, move in here, investigate once, right? Yeah. When, yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll grab this one because then we don't have to go in that location anymore. But if you're gonna come out of there next turn anyway, then... I think I think what we want to do 
is I'm gonna leave this clue here, do my stuff. Then next turn, I'll go first, investigate, then one of you can just send a peek and... Mm -hmm. Sure. And then we'll have like, ideally, most of someone else's, act, like most of one person's actions and all of the other person's actions to yeah. deal with whatever comes up, right? Okay. Yeah. Feel comfortable with that? Yeah, it's just, uh, Brit and I won't be able to investigate this whole thing this turn. That's yeah. cool. I think I do the best if I'm, take, if I'm not playing a turn. Yeah. Like, money is most valuable on me. I have the yeah. most use, the most, the most stupid dumps that I can throw it into. Right? I guess you can't. I'm, I'm fine not doing anything. It's fair so. for you to, like, investigate because you can't play things this turn. That's true. But you can't get here and investigate. Right? I could just grab four money, though. Because it would guess. be one, two, Like, I have three the Fire Axe, right I have Streetwise. I may or may not have other cards in my deck that can spend an infinite amount of money on. I guess, okay, we'll try and... I could just, like, move to the Ascending Path. Let's try, and, like, let's try and maximize our actions here, then. I'm going to Pathfinder to the Ascending Path and move into the Lost Garbage. Then we're going to investigate... We're going to commit Inquiring Mind for plus three to book. And we're going to spend... It's two plus two plus five. We're gonna go plus seven plus eight because my magnifying glass. And then, like, ideally, I'm gonna get two, and then Justin, you can go to like a tear in the path to get that one. So, I'm the alternative is if you do this, mm -hmm. then do this here, then move in here for the end of your turn, then I won't do all three clues, and then this one's even more of a sure thing. Yeah, that's pretty fair. Yeah. Okay, yeah, we'll we'll investigate before we go. Again, we'll inquire. We're not gonna spend too money though. Or we're, we're not, are we gonna spend money? Four, seven, eight to the things three. So you plus mean, five. I only yeah, need like, to succeed at all. So yeah, just don't get red or tentacle and then or blue and trick yourself into believing that three cards are yeah, more valuable. I'll take the clue because they might be. I don't know. And then come in here. Yeah, because you no, need I, a clue, right? That. You yeah. need clues. I won't, and I won't do I all. I need a clue of them. on my space. Yeah, I won't do them all. And I'll f test my first one too. Three against three. I'm a fucking idiot. I'm playing money <laughs> for brains. I'm playing this encounter fucking all wrong. <laughs> I thought this was just for books. <laughs> That's all I need. Man, I can spend all day in Sentinel Hill locations. God uh -huh. damn it. <laughs> oh man, grab a clue. <laughs> Fuck. This is why I didn't want that part of the card covered. Let's do it again. Good boy, Duke. Good boy. <laughs> And then we'll draw a cool. Oh no. It's okay. Oh, you're just bleeding a bit on the insides. Yeah. <laughs> you look at the thing. Opens up There's everything. <laughs> you just like reach in and like grab two parts of your stomach and like try and push them together and hold them like that for like 10 minutes. And you're like, maybe they'll seal itself back up. All like right, a paper uh, cut. I'm gonna move. I'll move here. I guess it doesn't matter. Like either way, I'm moving to to get here, and then I'll get two money. Card and a resource. A resource and a card, you mean? Uh, it says to do it the other way. I do that. What? <laughs> Fuck you. Doom on this for a two doom. Oh, that's cool. Search. No. Okay. Dust. All damage is direct. Oh, it's a dust. I was gonna die if I took damage anyway. All horror is direct. This is <clears> actually <throat> pretty good. Like, shuffle them up. It oh. just resets the clues for us. No, not that. Oh, just these things? The locations. The non Sentinel Hill locations. And so, we move back here. 
I'm not even scared of that one that deals brain damage me now, because I can get, like, fucking plus 10 brain this turn. Uh, this guy comes here. No, he doesn't. The near Sentinel Hill location? All monsters also move, yep. right? Yeah. What if he came to us? Yeah, he could if you want, if you want to kill him. No, that's not the near Sentinel Hill location, though. That's true. It's actually true. It's actually against the rules. And then we'll put those down with your dust. We're never going there. Yeah. Because one of them might give us three to You hear me, Brent? Never going there. Discard your thing. I don't want to. I have to test this. Test or three. Or don't. <laughs> like... I would like to keep the voices. <laughs> They're very comfortable. Sorry. This alcoholic and this homeless man. <laughs> this rampant alcoholic and this homeless man and his dog. Uh-oh. This could kill me. <gasps> okay, so I had seven, mi seven minus two. two. We're fine. <laughs> that could have been scary. I mean, like, it might not have been if you had, had like, a deck list of the cards. You, know, you should get that bulletproof vest. That'd be sick. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, like, there's probably another one, right? There is. I know, but, like, no, you should just give that to me, like, right now. We're not playing the teamwork build. <laughs> <laughs> no. All right, so should you go first to attempt to get a clue? One, man, which, what the one that punished you for having actions do? Okay, the one with no actions, the one with, with actions left was horror. I do not remember the other one. With actions left? Yeah, so you get one horror for each action you have remaining. Oh, that's dust. Yeah. Yeah, I'll go into, like, oh, man, we're... And then, if, if you get a clue, I'll move in here. Because I only have one action this turn, and then Brandon, you, Brandon you can follow and try to... someplace. Which one do you want? The middle one. Uh, take one horror for each action you have remaining. Take three horror. Two horror. Oh, three Not horror. Not three, yeah. because you yeah, pathfinder. That's right. Judge. I was trying to be Trixie. Yeah, because yeah, if I come in here, then you can come in and... Go, go. Oh, but he'll just go on me, won't he? Oh, he's dust. He'd be all like, he's... Johnny. What's he do? Just retaliate. Five, nine health, five, and one, one. That ain't so bad. Is he, a, is he an abomination or just a human? Human. Sorcerer elite. No, I have to play the safe. I can't draw a billion cards in case I draw my internal injury. Like, it'll, like I'll have to spend my turn doing that or it'll kill me, so. Yeah. I guess I can, like, burglary the later this turn. So, yeah, we'll investigate. Two to my four, five. Five to two. I'm pretty comfortable with that. You know, they just deal damage from here, right? Yeah, okay. I'll take a clue. They'll investigate with bur burglary. I just. Step the two. Would you like to fail and draw the card? I can't, damn it! <laughs> uh, I'll pass though. And Why then, can't you? Because I might draw my internal injury, which will just kill me. Oh. That's fair. I'll take another clue though. In addition to my free money. <laughs> so good. What do I do with my last action? Just <sighs> take my garbage can. Um, and then I'll test my frozen and fear, and you bet your ass I'll pay some money for this one. <laughs> <laughs> Step into the game's three. <laughs> I'm just passing this time. <laughs> As much as- man, I could have drawn, like, fucking 10 cards that turn. So, Brendan, you There's cool so with me moving in first? Sure. Alright, so first things first, I'm gonna get rid of my internal injury. Internal. Not eternal. It eternal is eternal. injury. It's and then I'll move in here. May I spend some of your clues? Mm-hmm. I prefer if you leave me with some, because they actually do things on me. Yep, yeah, I can leave you with one. Deal. Right. So this is gone because the thing is finished. Approaching 
What's that guy's fucking name? Seth Bishop. Approaching the peak of Sentinel Hill, you're confronted by several citizens of Dunwich. The man in the center of the circle chants in Latin while the others bow their heads in reverence. Seth Bishop, you ask presumptively. The man in the center raises his gaze in response, confirming your suspicions. You plead with the man to stop this madness, um, but he doesn't respond. You draw forth the silver constellation pendant you found on Salas' body and present it to Seth. This is all we found of your brother, you shout out over the howling wind. Is this the fate you want for yourself? For all of us? You throw the pendant onto the ground. Ugh! Staggered by the sight of it, he stumbles backwards and trips over his incantation, eyes widened. As he falls, the altar... Well, I'm doing everything right, right? Like, this is 2A, right? Yeah. yeah. I mean, like we say them. And we spent the six, yeah. It just seems weird from, like, yeah, like, this is all we found to your brother, but, like, what we fixed him. Um, you throw the pen onto the ground, staggered by the side of it, he stumbles backwards and trips over his incantation, eyes widened. As he falls, the altar behind him splits open and a torrent of energy pours from the stone, swirling into an open gate that swallows the man whole. You barely manage to get your heels in and grab hold of a nearby rock in time to resist the pull of the gate. Remove the set-aside Seth Bishop enemy from the game. Don't have to kill us, asshole. Free kill! Alright, what's act three? I mean, like, the also don't gain the victory for killing him, but True. that's fine. One, that's... Man, like... From the ruins of the headstone that altered the hill's peak, a gateway of trimming, vibrant energy has appeared. A force like a hurricane erupts from the gate, bending trees and pulling debris into it. The howl of the gale drowns out all other sound. Somehow, we must find a way to close the gate. Only investigators of Sentinel Peak may spend the requisite number of clues as a group to advance. Two per. Four shroud, two clues per. For when an investigator at this location draws a hex card, that investigator takes one damage. So. <laughs> we need you here, but not here at the same time, just so you know. I'm like, next shot is gonna go in there and just gonna do things. Yeah, because you only need, you can even like grab this one, right? <sighs> Ideally. Alright, Bryn. I thought there was going to be a big battle in here. Yeah, I mean, like... It's investigation time! <laughs> that was pretty lucky that that idiot fell into his own portal. <laughs> and that's what we get, like, we found his brother and we fixed yeah. him and he was just like, oh shit. I don't want that to happen to me. Well, I gotta play some of these or I'm gonna dump them. Whew. All right, so we just gotta. I feel, I pre feel pretty confident about this now. Yeah, we just gotta rush this. If we can clear all the stuff off, that we get two victory today. Yeah. How high can you get your book, hypothetically, <laughs> in one turn? Because if you could gain three or more clues all at once, we could just do it in one go. If I spent all my money, including the one I get for this round, next round, I'll have 18. Okay, because like we could just do it in one go. 18, 9, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, I can help with things. 20. No, I can't, just kidding. If I was willing to throw in my entire hand and pay all my money, I could get like 27. So we could do a double or nothing? <laughs> but like, and then just and then we don't draw. We then could do double squid. or nothing and then like do double and nothing again. <laughs> and still. Have what happens when I, I take damage, brain damage? Uh, the next time you try to draw, you take one direct four. Okay. So I can't put it on my big man. And you campus? shuffle and then draw. Okay. No, you can't put it on your big man. But he can't like... refresh your mind for you. No matter how much other kind of refreshing he does. Oh, he's refreshing, all right. Every end step. Or whatever step he does that in. After your turn ends. Which is, I guess, phase two end Every step. Every phase two. Hmm. Do you have any cards you could discard to help me investigate, Justin? Uh, what's your investigation <laughs> skill? I got three base. No, I, I can't yet. But uh, hopefully I can draw some. Okay. If you were one lower, I could. I could make this higher. Then yes, I could. <laughs> <laughs> does that work? It does. That's incredibly <laughs> awkward. <laughs> Can you help me, like, only if you can make it more difficult? Well, I can. Good. I um, guess. <laughs> Alright. Let's, uh, let's move in here. Rolling into dust. Um, we'll try to investigate, and I'll throw a double or nothing. So now it's double? So it's eight. Um, I'm going to have you rise to the occasion. Alright, so that's three. Then we can get three from the streetwise, which puts us at ten to With eight. With no, I do still have a clue, so we only need five to clear this one. So we're at 10 to 8. 
Make it 11 to 8. I have to say. Let's do two more. Let's make sure it 14 to 8. Yeah, don't jinx it. Boom, I'll get too close. Oh, it's so dumb. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, Jenny, it's right here. Look right here. And you're like, no, there's something under this big rock. <laughs> like, no, it's. <sighs> All right. Well, I'm not sure I can do too much else here. Like, I mean, I can try again. I can pick up another. I should be able to pick up another clue here. No, it's good. Like we want to clear this. I think we're at the position where we want to try and clear this out. To do yeah, it, and right? let's just hope we don't get like any enemies. But even then, we can deal with that. Like yeah, Bryn's got fire axe. That's what Bryn do. Yeah. Because realistically, Seven. I think I can just crush the rest of the clues there on my turn. Yeah. I think I hope. I should so. hope so because that's my job. That's what I can do. Boom! I'll get another clue. I'm done. Uh, like I have another action left, so I guess I'll get up. Money. Paying for it. Money draw card. Yeah. Yo, my good friend. Doom. Doom. <clears throat> Bryn. How do these locations work, uh, like pertaining to spying enemies? Spawning enemies. What's the condition? Ah, uh, it's a loopine throw. Far so it's like further from one of these would be furthest. Like, yeah. so we just move here as opposed to. Okay. I got a man for you to kill. Uh, this shroud is plus two. Dust. Oh, fuck. Remember how I said I could produce 27 book? Yep. I could make it 12. Why don't you go first, then? Oh, we, uh, yeah, we have no one drew hexes. We just ten. did the No, we just all drew monsters. Okay. Oh, is this a hex? No, it's a hazard. One, two, three. Pathfinder here. Move in here for one. Investigation time boys. Pumpy Tutors, how's it going? Commit my search for the truth. Four, five, six, seven, eight. How much is this? Six. Nine, ten, nine, 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 twelve, fourteen. Yeah. Fourteen to six sounds good. Yeah. Do you want to try and just do it now? That's up to you. Yeah, I mean, if you, you spend I mean, everything, like, right? It would be 12. 14. X would be 12. Sure, let's do it. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21 to 12. Yeah. You get plus one from this card. 22 to 12. Not the red, anything but the red one. Yeah. Take all the, take, yeah, all the clues. Should we spend them now because we win? Yes. You can read it. Yeah. You don't know how to close the swirling gate before you don't know how to close the swirling gate before you. And with each passing moment, the force from within it grows in strength. You fear that whatever entity the sorcerers have summoned from beyond approaches. With no time to spare, you turn to the open tome of the stone altar. Desperate for answers are one. I think we dodged a lot of really hard stuff. R1, the poorly bound tome appears to be written records of old Waitley, the man who taught Wilbur the ancient secrets of sorcery. You find a passage describing a place outside of time and space where worlds converge and young Sothal dwells. Only by reaching this nexus at the edge of reality can you unmake the tear that has split open the world. Feeling as if you may be going to your doom, you must have a final ounce of courage and step into the gate. Your campaign log records that the investigators entered the gate. Oh. We get victory X equal to what we got. So two. Okay. That'd be good. Good. Yeah, that idiot falling into his own portal was very helpful for us. Yep. Five, three, four. Uh, yeah, if you lose this one, each of us gets written insane and the campaign's over. Oh! <laughs> oh yeah oh wow <laughs> you're just you're dumb glad we dodged that bullet yeah 
that. That's why I said we need to win. Yeah. I imagine this one's a bit lighter on, like, why this deck is so big. It's, it's it so very that, high variance. Yeah. Which makes it so that... Like, you don't hit the insane cards over and over again. Yeah. yeah. Hey, Bubba Tears. Uh, can you give that everyone a try then? Heck yeah. Clean this one up? Heck yeah.